Well, the experience with Muse to date has uh, paralleled uh, uh, prior successes with other suturing devices and even improved upon uh, some of those successes. And uh, the promise of Muse, of course, is with the nature of the stapling is that it'll be more durable and lasting effect. Uh, so in general, our patients can expect that uh, 80% will uh, be either off their uh, proton pump inhibitors or have it significantly reduced. And uh, uh, this is not quite the success of surgery, but it's achieved with uh, far less intervention and uh, quicker recovery. And the other aspect of that is that uh, it can be repeated. Uh, there's uh, no reason why you can't repeat it, and it doesn't interfere with uh, subsequent surgery. So I think uh, overall, it's a, a very good uh, profile in terms of the, the benefits and the successes of Muse in terms of coming off of medication. I, I think there are two reasons why uh, Muse and uh, endotherapy for GERD uh, really is going to be very successful. Uh, one of the reasons is that uh, therapeutic endoscopy has advanced over the last decade. What we are focused totally on now in endoscopy is therapeutics. And I think this change in the mindset of the endoscopist has allowed us to uh, open up a huge field of intervention, you know, one of which is, is the treatment of GERD. The other uh, reality, if you like, which has uh, finally dawned upon us is that the gold standard that we established for ourselves 20 years ago, which was to normalize acid exposure in the esophagus, is a very tarnished gold standard. Now, that, the concept of normalizing acid exposure as essential to any therapy is debunked.